getting started here and uh, how excited you are to get going? No, I mean, I'm happy playing wherever. So, I mean, if, if I was here, you know, or somewhere else, it wouldn't really matter to me. I'm happy playing this game. But, you know, I've played with a lot of guys here. And, you know, coming here for the short time I was here last year was great, even though the numbers didn't show it. But, uh, you know, like I said, I'm just happy playing the game. And, you know, just, you know, I'm the, as close as we are to Boston, that's always a good thing, too. So, just, you know, just ready to play with the guys. I've been playing with these guys for, for a few years now. So, I know most of them and got to know the rest of them in spring training. So, we should have a really good team chemistry and, you know, win some ball games out here. Josh, how important is it for you to play so well during the spring? Try to keep that up, try to open up some more eyes. Well, you know, it's kind of kind of one thing you think about it. You know, I've had these three days off. It kind of makes me wonder if I'm going to, you know, be able to do that again. But, you know, just kind of take the same approach that I have been in spring and try not to do too much up there and, you know, get the fastballs that I know I can hit and lay off the stuff early in the count and play the game hard like I always have. You excited about opening day? Well, I think everybody is. I mean, anytime you come out here opening day for a Triple A team, especially with the Red Sox, is going to be fun. You know, especially it's not cold out here, so we should have a good good fan base coming in. So hopefully that'll be a good thing. But you know, just just got to take it as another game and play the game hard. Yeah. I was going to say, would you say the same thing if it was raining and 40 degrees right now? Probably not. You know, I'm I'm from Georgia. We don't like that cold weather down there. So I'm, I'm kind of excited for this weather. Uh, as you look at this, the makeup of this team, uh, what do you see? Oh, we got a lot of veterans out here. We got a lot of uh, experience, and then you know I think I want to say I'm the youngest one on the team right now. So we've got a bunch of guys who know what they're doing and have been in this business for a while. So we're all pretty smart about this game, and we don't have any you know the younger like 20, 21 year olds who don't know what to do. And we all know how to carry ourselves as opposed to a clubhouse and on the ball field. So and, uh, all in all, I think we're going to be a pretty smart team. Thank you. Yep. What's something that you're going to work mostly on here in Pawtucket? Uh, you know, I think there's two things, you know, I can still improve on the plate discipline. That's one thing. But, uh, you know, I need to work on gaining weight again. You know, I mean, my first two years, I was 170, 174. And now I think last year, I finally was able to maintain weight of about 180, 184. So hopefully I can get that weight pushed up to about 190 and keep it there and I'll be satisfied. What's the reason for it? Why to come down the weight? Uh, I mean, just, you know, I'm a growing kid, 23 years old, and I'm six foot two almost, so 100, 180 pounds is kind of still wiry, so I need to put on a little bit of muscle and kind of fill out to where I need to be. So, I mean, that'll make me just that much stronger without losing the speed that I have. Do you go in into the beginning of the season, you know, knowing that, that you can make it at the major league level, and does that affect you yeah. if you do? Uh, you know, I mean, I had a feeling coming in the spring that I wasn't going to make the team out of, out of the shoot if, unless somebody went down. So that was kind of an easier thing to relax and not think about it a whole lot. So, I mean, I kind of went in the mindset with that, just go out there and try to open a little bit more eyes that I, than I did last year, and it worked out for me. You know, it did really well. But, you know, and then right there at the end, you know, Hermita went down, and it was kind of a, you know, a coin toss whether I was going to be with them or not. They told me if he was down, then I'd start with them. But if not, then I'd be here. So, I mean, either way, I'm just I'm happy to be able to play the game, you know, be healthy and play the game. But do you think this spring, you know, you sort of proved that, that maybe you belong at the major league level? I mean, is that what you, that's what you try to prove in spring? Yeah, no, I think, I think so. I think I proved to, these, to those guys that I, if I can play every day, you know, I can hit that kind of pitching and get the opportunity to play that, you know, I'm ready. And, uh, you know, I kind of hit a speed bump with that last year, not playing every day in September. So I've got to make that adjustment as well if I'm not going to be an everyday guy to start off.